Ah, Hello? Hello, I missed Carl through you. Uh, all right, yeah, just one second. Is it Kiri Ann? Who's asking? Hey, it's Mr. Waller. Mr. what, sorry? Mr. Waller, W A W L E R. Right, okay, who's that? I'm an enforcement officer with JBW on behalf of Bow and Furnace Council and the Majesty's Court. Okay. It's in relation to your outstanding council tax. Okay, what are you ringing me for? What am I ringing you for? Yeah. Because a warrant's been issued, Miss Devlin, for enforcement against you under the property for non payment of council tax. You right. saw our way across there now. You're aware of the situation. Are you aware of the situation that I've actually called your office explaining that I'm a vulnerable household and that I've removed your implied right of access? And that you what, sorry? That I'm a vulnerable person. I've actually spoke to your office and explained that twice now, that I'm classed as a vulnerable person and that I've removed your implied right of access. You can't, you can't remove the implied right of access when a court warrant exists. Sorry? Uh, the judge or magistrate at the Majesty's Court issued a warrant Council tax. You, you don't have the power to remove an implied right of access when a warrant is issued by the court. That's just criminal law, unfortunately. It's a little gibberish. Anyway, anyway, anyway you've never provided any proof of any vulnerability, Mr. Devlin. I have. Even though you were requested to, you've not supplied that. Who's requesting me to supply anyway. that? I've, I've rang you up. Your office has explained that before. Explains that I'm a vulnerable household. Listen, so you're going to attend my property to remove goods, is that what you're telling me? That's correct, that's correct. And to carry out enforcement against you for non payment. Okay. So okay. we're on our way now. Right, uh, so what are you going to, what, you, what are you going to do if I don't open the door? How are you going to get in? Well, it's quite simple. If you don't open the door, once we're in attendance at the property, because a warrant exists for enforcement of the premises issued by Her Majesty's Court, Right. Um, and you're now on notice that that warrant is due for enforcement this morning. If we refuse or deny access to the property or the goods within, Baron Furnace Council will make apply to the court immediately for a warrant of entry. We'll be required to remain on site in attendance at the property while the application is processed. Uh, and if it's granted successfully by Her Majesty's Courts, the court will then appoint a locksmith to attend the premises and he could uh, face locksmith's charges as well as £110 if goods are removed. £15 in the storage plus V18 for a minimum of seven days and auctioning is free. Okay? Well, I have to make you aware, Mr. Devlin, that all calls are recorded. If you don't give consent for recording to take place, uh, then advise you now, and I will switch off the recording device. But before you make that decision, I'd like you to bear in mind that the recording is there for your protection and for mine. Okay? Absolutely, fine, I understand that. I'm actually recording all conversations that I have with you on in your company yeah. anyway, well, so. Before, before you record anybody, by law, you have to ask permission to record, which is what I've just done with you, okay? Right, now, well, I don't, give, I don't give you permission to record me. Do you give me permission oh, to record okay. you? Yeah, so I'll switch off the recording device. Give us a second. All right, thank I'll you. I'll just ask you for permission. Then yeah. Give us a second. Right, the recording device is switched off. Okay. Right, so we're on our way now. I expect to be with you around about quarter to 10, 10 o'clock this morning. Uh, because the calls are recording, I have to advise you that you do have the right to clear the outstanding balance, which is £682.87 on the credit card or debit card before we arrive at the property to stop enforcement action taking place and to stop any further charges being on us. If you're unable to make the payment yourself, we are authorised to accept third party payments if somebody's willing or able to clear the balance on your behalf. But again, that would need to be on a credit card or debit card before we arrive at the property. Once we're in attendance at the property, the additional charges may be added and I cannot affect that and I cannot adjust that. Okay? Well, not really. I'm not actually at the property at the moment anyway. You don't need to be there. That's why the court condition of warrants and non-payment of council tax is an offence, Mr. Devlin. Oh, no, I and understand. Offense, I understand that. for which the court would now issue a warrant against you. Hmm. Okay? Right. So, we're on our way. I'll be with you very shortly and we'll, take, we'll deal with it from there, okay? <laughs> Do you hear that?